Oh, that is not good for my knee. You okay? Oh. Yeah. Oh. Uh, where are we? Some kind of trap. Which we gotta get out of. Castle, do you have anything in your vest that can help us? Oh, yeah, heck, I got a guppy multi-tool, got a solar-powered hand fan, got camo glasses, built-in compass, snake bite kit. So nothing? Well, not nothing. I can build a fire. Oh, great. You know what, Castle? I can pull myself out if you could boost me up. Well, then how am I gonna get up? <laughs> I have a rope in the car. I was gonna hike back to get it. You're gonna leave me here alone? Okay, well, just hold on a second. Let's just back up and think about this. What is this pit doing out here in the first place? Someone or something had to build it. Something, Castle? You think that Bigfoot came out here with a shovel? No, you're probably right. I don't think Bigfoot built this. Yeah, some hunters or poachers probably dug it up. Hunting what? Look at the size of this thing. Maybe our fugitive built it in case anyone came out here. It's more comfortable with the idea of Bigfoot building. Come on, Kessel. Why don't you pop a squat? We'll pull a cheerleader and move it. Shouldn't you be wearing a short skirt for this? That's the rule. <laughs> you know, though, this pit is kind of crudely built. It's, uh, some primates have been known to <laughs> make it. Oh, jeez, Castle! Use tools to trap prey. Could you stand still? Holy! Yeah, I'm just saying I don't want to end up as Bigfoot dinner. You know, Castle, there is a bit of poetic justice in this. Poetic justice how? Well, I mean, think about it. You set a trap for Alexis, and now someone or something has set one for you. Promise me you'll come back. In case I don't make it. Oh, that's cute. But seriously, hurry back. Okay? <laughs> <laughs>